Today's project is a dop bag. I've never made one before. I've never installed a zip before. What could go wrong? Okay, let's get cutting. And like magic, in a couple of minutes of cutting, we've got a bag, or the start of a bag. So next, I'm gonna work out where to put the zip. So according to this, 10, 200, 10. So, ten, you got to work out roughly where the middle is. So, ten, five. Ten and then five. Then we want to draw a line roughly between these two marks. Um, right. On Timu, I actually bought some cheap zip packs because. <laughs> I wanted to learn how to install zips and I figured why buy expensive ones when cheap ones will do now if we compare it to the ruler and to the metal line to the metal line that's roughly 20 centimeters what I'm actually going to do I may as well try and run it full length for this 20 centimeters so I'm going to grab my tools for what I think will make a hole for a zip. But this looks like it's wide enough. So if I put this here, and I'll find a hammer. There we go. I believe that's through. And we think this is roughly where it starts. Once when next we'll cut out a slot to match the holes. No, it's not gotta be perfect because this dot bag is for me. But being perfect would be really nice. I'm doing round two. So there we have a zip slot, which I've never done before. And I think. See how that looks. You know what? For a first try at making a zip slot, it's not looking too bad, is it? Okay, so what I'm going to do now, apart from being annoyed with this bit, To release the tape because this will hold it in place while I this will hold it in place while I stamp it I'll stitch it in place scissors close by I've got these big ones instead So 
got to get these ends up. Right, it seems to have it. I can just see the metal bit, which is what sort of I wanted anyway. Try and work out. That's roughly on the money. That went through way too easy. Um, bit that's worrying me is here and how it will react with the teeth. So we're just gonna now it may not look good with the two dots or the two holes close together, but it will mean that I can sew a loop in over each side. So we can stop the zip coming back too far. We can then trim and, trim and tidy these. And I'm going to do the sewing off camera. Okay. So after a bit of stick, gonna just simply unzip. Okay, so we're going to mark it here and here. Move the ruler over. I'm going to square up this edge just for. And then when I come to sew things in, I will sew them in with these. And we'll be looking at the end product, I think. We have a bag with a handle and it zips. Now what I intend to do is trim these edges but for your first dot bag I think this is what you'd call a success. I'm not put things in. It 
works quite nice. I'm, I'm really, really pleased with it. Look at them threads. 